Hello, boys and girls. It's Miss Ferreira. I'm back with another book to read aloud to you today with my mom, Mrs. Farrow. Hi, boys and girls. And I have another Mo Willems book, another Elephant and Piggy book. And this one is called, Are You Ready to Play Outside? I know in springtime, I love going outside. The weather's nice, but sometimes, you know, it can be a little chilly. It's not quite summertime yet. It's not too warm. And some days are nicer than others. So you'll see something happens in this book. We're going to read it and see what happens. Remember, we're working on dramatizing our characters. So we're going to try to act it out as best as we can and read with expression. You ready? Yes, I am. My mom's going to be Elephant and I'm going to be Piggy. Are You Ready to Play Outside? By Mo Willems. Piggy! Gerald! Are you ready to play outside? Yes, yes, yes. We are going to do everything today. We are going to run. We are going to skip. We are going to jump. Nothing can stop us. Uh-oh. What do you think is happening? What do you oh, think? Oh, no. What is that? Plink. I think that's water dropping from somewhere. Uh-oh. Oh, no. It's starting to rain. It is raining. It is pouring. So you see it's raining in this one, but now it's getting heavier. So that's why he's saying it's pouring. Ooh. Oh, look, Elephant is cleaning his glasses. Maybe you should dramatize that. Uh, Let me take off your glasses. Pretend you're drawing them off. Come on. <laughs> No. We have a shy reader right now. <laughs> it is really pouring. I have never seen so much rain in my life. See, look, he had to take his glasses off to dry them off. Somebody didn't want to act that out. She's not being a good student right now. <laughs> I do not like rain. See, I'm acting it out. Yeah, you are. Mm hmm I am not a happy pig. Aww. Look, even his ears are pointing down. You can tell he's not happy just with the illustration. Hmm? What do you think happened? It just stopped raining? Could be, or maybe he's being protected by something. Oh, like maybe an umbrella? Yes, okay. maybe an umbrella. Let's see. <gasps> Thank Aww. you, Gerald. Well, it's not an umbrella, boys and girls. Gerald's using his ear to protect his friend from the rain. He's such a good friend. He really is, because look, he's still getting soaked by the rain, but his friend is being protected by him. But it is still raining. <sighs> See, I acted out that. It says, grr. But I made a noise that I would normally make. <clears throat> yeah, she makes that noise. When do I usually make that uh, noise? When you're angry with me. <gasps> Don't believe her. <laughs> How can anyone play outside with all this rain? I must be in a bad mood. Rain! Yay! Who normally likes rain, boys and girls? I would think birds, they like splashing sure. in the rain. But also, <gasps> worms like to play in the rain. Little earthworms. Yep. So, Piggy isn't liking the rain too much, but the worms are really enjoying it. 
Splash, splish, splash, splish, splash, splish. And Piggy's still being protected. Yep. Elephant's still standing over him, protecting with his ear. Not complaining either. Not complaining at all. They are having fun. Maybe we can have fun too. That's a good way of looking yes, at it. Yes, it is. I have a smart friend. Mm-hmm. We can try. You think they're going to have fun? Let's see. Splash! Splash. Oh, do any of you like to do that in puddles? I'm sure you do, but I don't think your parents like it too much. <laughs> this is great! Let's play! So what do you notice about Piggy? Think about how he was feeling before, how the story first started. They wanted to play outside, how he was feeling. Then it started raining, and I think his feelings changed. You think Piggy's feelings because changed? Because of his good friend that made him feel better. But now his, well, it started raining. See, in the beginning, he was so excited, he mm -hmm. wanted to play outside. But then it started raining. And he wasn't happy anymore. Nope. He was upset. And then his friend helped him. And he was very grateful for that. Mm -hmm. But he still was a little upset because they couldn't really have fun together outside. But now all of a sudden, he's enjoying it. Mm -hmm. So his feelings changed a lot in this story. Run, run, run. Skip, skip, skip. Oh, I'm glad they're having fun in the rain now. Me too. They're loving the rain. Jump, jump, jump. I love rain. Well, he changed his mind quickly. Yeah, he did. Oh, it's my turn. I'm sorry. I hope it rains all day. Oh boy. What do you see happening? Oh, looks like things are slowing down. Uh-oh. Rats. And now the sun's out. Now, you would think he'd be happy. Yes. Right? Mm -hmm. But I wonder why he's not happy. Because he was having fun in the rain. He learned to have fun in the rain. Yes. See that? Now I like rain, and now the rain has stopped. Are you kidding me? See, if this happened earlier, he would have been happy. Right. Do not worry, Piggy. Oh, you skipped me. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> You gotta wait your turn. Okay, sorry. I'm excited. <laughs> I am not a happy pig. Do not worry, Piggy. I have a plan. Hmm, a plan? What could Elephant be up to? It's not like he can control the weather and make no. it rain again. <gasps> rain! How did he make did it he rain? Yes. How what do you think? Be? What do you think, boys and girls? <sighs> Elephants make the best friends. Aww. See that? So Elephant did make it rain in his own way. Aww. The end. <gasps> what do you see here? There's the pigeon. All right, boys and girls. Yesterday we had a focus with dramatizing the characters and how to bring them to life. And also even on the pages where there's no words at all, I'm gonna review that real fast. Oh, let me just find a page first. See on this page, no words, but we can see there are things happening so you can still dramatize it. Today I want you to focus on rereading books to bring it even more to life. So I think after I end this video, I'm gonna read this book again 
with my mom and I'm going to make her act it out more. Like maybe she'll take her glasses off this time and dry them off from the rain. And I want to bring it to life too. I'll act it out more too. Maybe I'll actually stand up and run on this part. And maybe I'll stand up and skip and jump, but I'm not going to jump like that. I'm, I might hurt myself. I don't mm. think we need any injuries today. No, not today. So boys and girls, today I want you to just reread your books, but bring them to life. Now, after you read it the first time, you know the story and you're able to bring it to life the next time you read it by putting more dramatization and expression into it. So you ready to do that now? Sure. All right, boys and girls, while we're doing that, you have fun with your books and rock on. Rock on. Bye. See you Bye, tomorrow. Bye, boys and girls.